Well, hello there. If you're new, I'm Mika. And today's video is Wash Day on Relax Day. If you're a returning subscriber, oh, welcome. I'm so happy to have you. Let's get started. And these are the products that I'll be using. The Motion Deep Penetrating Treatment. And I'll be using three spoonful of this. I will be applying this treatment after my shampoo. Then I'll be adding the grapeseed oil, one teaspoon. Avocado oil, one teaspoon. And then I'm going to mix it until the oil disappears into the moisture treatment. Before washing my hair, I'm going to prepare it by detangling my hair. I'm just using my fingers and then I'm going to go in with a white tooth comb and I'm going to detangle the hair from the ends to the root. This is how my hair is looking after detangling it. Using my fingers, I'm going to section my hair into four in preparation for my hair brushing. Brushing your hair before you shampoo it helps to remove dead cells. It also improves blood circulation and adds sheen and luster to your hair. As you can see, I'm using my fingers to make a parting and then I am brushing from the scalp area onto the hair shaft. The brush that I'm using is a natural bristle brush. So it's very soft to the touch. So it's quite soothing. Once I've finished brushing my hair, I'm just going to direct all hair towards the back in the same manner as how I'm going to be shampooing my hair. To shampoo my hair, I'm using the Shea Moisturizer Jamaican Black Castor Oil Shampoo. And this is a non-sulfate shampoo. Now I'm just getting my hair wet thoroughly before I apply the shampoo to my hair. Now this is the first shampoo. Usually the first shampoo does not lather much and that is simple because of the dirt and oil buildup that is on the hair. So I'm making sure to rinse my hair thoroughly after each shampoo. In the second shampoo, you'll notice that my hair lathers much more than in the first wash or shampoo. And that is simple because some of the buildup was removed in the first wash. So now it is going to lather much more. 
To scrub my scalp, I'm using the pads of my fingers. Make sure to keep your hair nice and smooth while shampooing it. As you can see, as what I'm doing. And while rinsing, keep the hair nice and straight and smooth. And just gently carry the hair, your hands in a downward motion. And this is the third and final wash. Yes. So now you're going to see that my hair lathers even more because now it is very much clean. So it's going to lather much more now. If you're enjoying the video, don't forget to give the video a like. Hit that thumbs up right down below. Now I'm just using my hands to squeeze out the excess water from my hair before I towel blot it. Now I'm just using my hands to gently squeeze the excess water from my hair and notice that I'm just patting to get the excess water out. It is important not to use a towel to rub onto your hair as this can be damaging to your cuticles. To apply the treatment that I made earlier, I am using my hands to section my hair into four just for control so that I can apply the treatment easily to my hair. Starting at the back, I am using my hands to apply the treatment to my hair from the roots to the ends and I'm using my fingers to make the partings. Keep in mind also that you can use an applicator brush to apply the treatment to your hair. And here's a little surprise for you. Look at that. I am making sure that everything comes out of that bowl and go into my hair. Let nothing waste. Now I'm just covering my hair with a plastic cap and I'm going to be sitting under the dryer for 30 minutes. Once the 30 minutes is up, I'll cool down and then I am going to be adding water to my hair and Using a white tooth comb, I am going to detangle from the ends to the root. While detangling the hair, make sure that you are taking your time as doing it improperly can cause ear breakage. So once I've finished detangling my hair, I am just going to rinse my hair thoroughly in preparation for the next step. So stay tuned and keep watching. 
If you're new, don't forget to subscribe. And if you're a return visitor who have not yet subscribed, what are you waiting on? Go right ahead and subscribe. Turn that subscribe button down below from red to black. enjoying the video don't forget to like it and this is the finish look all done and clean and now it is time to style my hair if you watch my videos frequently you know i love to roller set my hair but this time i did something different i did a braid out so if you're interested in seeing how i did this braid out and how i style it then go right ahead and subscribe and if you're already subscribed please turn on your notification bell so when i put out that video you'll be the first to be notified and i will see you in my next video bye bye